And the framework will be also Gartner presented this framework of ordinary divide that is called the AI opportunity radar, right? Where you think on the X axis, is it a case that will be an everyday solving or is it a case that could be a game changer for you to consider? Is it a case that will solve internal operation efficiency or is it a case that will be more about external customer facing, uh, changing the engagement or the way new solution and so on? Then. Uh, so it's another way to plot that is interesting also to consider how to think about the use case that you have. Okay? But the one thing to be careful, right, is that generative AI is not replacing uh, a traditional ML, right? Generative is still a subset of AI, okay? Traditional ML can still be better in some use case, okay? After, of course, the, the difference is that generative can still be game changer because of what it brings, but also the easiness of access and so on, right? To work on traditional AML is more focused on some specific tasks where you train, you train, you need some data and then become very good in some of in the area, right? Genetic AI with the access of general knowledge will do a lot of things from the start that you, of course, continue to optimize according to also the things that you want, okay? But generative AI, again, will not solve everything, right? As we say, gen uh, generative AI is good for some of the some of the business use cases that I share, right? Traditional LML will still be better for things like predictive analytics, anonymity detection, for detection, recommendation, intelligence data decision that can still be better if you train correctly your your, uh, your machine learning. But what is good also is to combine them. 